I don't think I fell off. I think I may be more stagnated. Like maybe I'm where I stopped at. Mm -hmm. And, you know, to people that might be there, they might think that's falling off. Recently, rapper Blueface has been making headlines for either his toxic relationship or multiple felony charges. There was a time when he was being called a star in the making, but now no one can be sure about that. After his recent controversies, hip-hop fans have already given the verdict that Blueface is over. Before we get started, make sure to leave a like and comment on this video. Also, if you'd like to join this month's giveaway of a brand new iPhone, then all you have to do is subscribe to the channel and watch this video until the end to find and comment the hidden message. Good luck. Left a promising career as an athlete. Jonathan Jamal Porter, a.k.a. Blueface, was born in L.A. on the 20th of January, 1997. As a kid, he moved around a lot and kept hopping from one elementary school to another. First, he was living with his mother in the Santa Clarita Valley, but then he went to his father and lived in Oakland. Blueface went to Arlita High School after relocation to San Fernando. There, he became an all-rounder. He played saxophone in a band and became the star quarterback on the football team. He even made his high school team win the championship in the 2014 East Valley League. There was a time when Jonathan only wanted to be an athlete, but then in a moment of haste, he decided not to pursue it. He even referred to his star quarterback past in his hit track, Thotiana. He even disclosed the reason in that music video as the football player only wanted to choose women and fame. Blueface was mostly unemployed before he became a rapper. He only did a few odd jobs and even used to get fired quickly. The infamous Twitch stream couple appearance. Blueface and Krishan Rock are probably one of the most notorious couples in the hip-hop scene. Their arguments have been nasty and fights have been violent. Just in October of 2022, Krishan made a video of busted lips and a black eye hinting towards physical assault. She then took the claim back by saying it was her own doing as she was too drunk and tried to jump out of a car. On the 21st of November, Blueface and his girlfriend went live with Kai Sinat, a popular Twitch streamer. Whoever saw that live could see how much of a toxic couple Porter and Rock were. What shocked people the most was how Blueface was trying to remain relatively calm while Krishan was totally unhinged. She threw a person and broke something. To this, the 25-year-old rapper said to Kai, You should see my house, insinuating that she keeps breaking stuff at home, too. Krishan replied that she does that when Blueface tries to kick her out, and then she tells him she ain't going anywhere. Many viewers thought that the L.A. rapper most certainly needed help to get out of that relationship. She really kept her word and even announced that she won't be leaving the rapper's side, even after he got arrested on attempted murder charges. Making a cult on OnlyFans Blueface seems to have a problem with sticking to one career. He did that with his athletic career, and now he's done the same thing with rapping. In 2018, he saw a meteoric rise with two big songs. He even collaborated with rappers like Cardi B, Snoop Dogg, and various others. In 2020, he started his own reality show on OnlyFans and named it Blue Girls Club. The show gets women from all over the USA to participate. However, many people have talked against this show and compared it to a cult. They've even called Blueface the new R. Kelly because they think he's also exploiting young women. On this show, the women are pressured into doing all kinds of derogatory stuff. In one task, Blueface had asked them to get a tattoo of his name as a pledge to show their loyalty. Physical fights break out regularly on the show, and there are no safety measures for the women. Girls who have participated in the first season even warned others about it and asked young gullible girls to stay away from it. Jonathan's own girlfriend got into a physical altercation with his ex-girlfriend on the show. Past run-ins with the law. 2018 was the year when Blueface was making a good name for himself. His songs were getting viral and his fandom was growing. However, on the 16th of November 2018, Porter got arrested for shooting at an occupied vehicle. Later, the camera footage showed that the man was trying to rob Blueface at the Chevron gas station and he shot at the suspect's car in response to the attempted robbery. But shooting at an occupied vehicle is a felony in California, so he got arrested for it. Later, he was released on $69,000 bail. Two months later, the Stop Cap and Rapper got arrested again for having an unregistered loaded gun. Following that, 
Blueface only kept on making news for his controversies. In December of 2019, he put his video online where he was throwing money at the crowd in one of the poorest areas of Los Angeles. The video got a polarizing reaction. Some tried to justify his behavior by saying at least he was doing something good, while others called it a disgraceful act. A 2022 murder charge. In 2022, the rapper got into serious trouble as he's now been arrested on attempted murder charges. On the 15th of November of 2022, Porter was with his girlfriend, Krishan Rock, when undercover cops arrested him. He was taken to Clark County Detention Center in Las Vegas, and according to a statement from the Las Vegas Metropolitan Police, in the official statement, the police said the rapper was booked on the count of attempted murder with a deadly weapon and discharging a firearm at into an occupied structure. That shooting took place on the 8th of October. Right now, a $50,000 bond has been set, and the hearing for this case will begin in January. In the last few years, Blueface has been successful in keeping himself safe from going behind bars, but this time, the charges are no joke. The prosecutors are also trying their best to get him locked up due to his long charge sheet. Since Blueface hasn't made any memorable track since 2019, the record producers also won't be pulling any strings to get him a plea. All of these factors point towards the fact that Blueface will be facing one tough and long trial in the upcoming year. Many of his fans have already prepared themselves that the once promising rapper might not be coming back anytime soon. And with this, we've come to the very end of this video. Tell us in the comments below what your thoughts on Blueface are and his upcoming trial. Let us know your thoughts on the whole video below. Don't forget to leave a like on this video if you're new to this channel and make sure to hit that subscribe button for all future content. Thanks for watching. Until next time.